I have to wonder, is fighting against us truly what you want to do? I can't bear to fight against you without knowing the truth. So no ace pilot interviews this time. Last time, uh, we got a lot closer to acing a lot of our characters. Um, have I done suborders yet? Yes, I have. Okay. Spin my attack points and stuff. Okay. Next one is Beyond the Gloomy Light. This is our next mission. We have. Do I have more? When do I get my next batch of um, DLC missions? After 42. So, for the next mission, and maybe the secret mission that goes with it, we will unlock our next batch of um, port missions. We also have a big. Uh, another split coming up. We'll talk more about that when we come to it. Good news is I've already unlocked the secret scenario next. All right. So we're at the office of Desla. I was literally in combat with the Terran fleet. Feet. What kind of fuss is this? Calling me here and forcing me all to retreat from battle like that. How insolent of you, Ad General Admiral Domel. Or perhaps simply Domel would be more appropriate. I apologize, Your Excellency. The ship that was, har that was harboring the Supreme Leader was destroyed by an unknown agent. The Supreme Leader Desla is dead. Assassinated. I know enough about Yamato that that's obviously bogus. Uh, considering that the Gamelins have like really leaned into the Nazi trappings and stuff, um, is this meant to be a take on Operation Valkyrie or the uh, uh, the, the, that that uh, assassination attempt, the attempted assassination of Hitler? What? He dispatched a ballot for an inspection, but, the, but this fact of their course were only known by two senior officers. One of those was Space Fleet Commander Admiral Dietz, the other was you. What are you trying to say? I'm saying that you are accused of being the mastermind behind this plot to assassinate... Oops, I'm sorry. I am misplaying this... I, I've failed to give a good look at this character and get a good grasp of what their voice should be. That was a bit too nasal and harsh. I'm saying that you're accused of being the mastermind behind this plot to assassinate the Supreme Leader. Th that's absurd! We colluded with that of Deeds, and together formulated a plot to assassinate the Supreme Leader and take control of the Empire of yourselves, did you not? I'm guessing this is, this is the guy's name is Dommel? I'm assuming this is meant to be a reference to Rommel getting roped into one of the assassination plots again, or, um being executed or accused of being part of the out not executed, but being accused of being part of one of the assassination plots against Hitler and being thus been forced to commit suicide. I refuse to respond to such ludicrous accusations. Ludicrous accusations? I beg to differ. After all, your loving wife has been apprehended as well. Yep, this is a reference to Rommel. Eliza? What has she ever done? This is madness. Oh, didn't you know? She was inspiring the known anti-government movement. This must be some mistake. Anyone here can tell you that these are the facts. It can't be. This nation functions under the order of law. This order, that order must be protect, protected. And we're totally not staging a coup on our own and attempting to use and using you as our scapegoat for our seizing of power. And who up this order? must be punished. That is the law. What is the law? No eat meat. Gimli! You disgust me, Domo. Take responsibility for your actions like a man. How did this happen? Back at the gate.
So if we jump through the go through the subspace gate, we should jump to the balance system, right? That's right. The balance system is located between our galaxy and the large Magellanic crowd, cloud. I guess you could say it's a kind of space lighthouse. So it's the midway point for our journey to Iskandar. Balan also acts like a hub station for the warp network, from what I've heard. Warp network? Hub station? I'm lost. The animals play subspace gates in the large Magellanic cloud and in Balan so they can easily warp to and from those two areas. It's believed that Balan is home to gates to other galaxies as well. But that is their warp base station, as it were. So all we need to do is make it to Balan then. Exactly. We can hopefully use the gates located there to warp directly to the large Magellanic cloud. That'll cut down our schedules considerably. Hopefully now we can forget worrying about being late. Let me introduce the person who gave us this invaluable information. Narisha's out of her coma, apparently. She is so beautiful. She looks like Operations Officer Mori. Her name is Yurisha. She is a messenger from Iskandar. She does look a lot like Mori, doesn't she? She's the Iskandarian envoy who lent her aid from the large Magellanic Cloud to save Earth. Even I thought the same thing with Melda, but she doesn't really look anything. But she really doesn't doesn't really look any different from an Earthling. I know she's pretty, but stop fawning over her, please. Baka Shinji. She was unconscious with the Yamato's autom automatic navigation system. However, it appears that she was, has been awakened from our enemy's psychological attack during that last battle. And, in her, and her newly awakened consciousness has been taken in by Yuria? It seems as though I was chosen, rather than anything I actually did myself. Through resistance, we were able to op successfully operate the gate control system. Thank you for all your help. I prefer gratitude through actions rather than words. As do I. You will make it, s and we will make it so. Now, Yurisha, let me show you around the ship. Thank you, Yuki. Yurisha, she seems different from when she was in Mis Misaki's body. I agree. I'm a little behind the uh, video. I'm gonna make sure to make some adjustments to this later. How so? Hmm, how do I explain it? Before she was more aloof, approachable, but really hard to get at, you know? So, a uh, kind of cute, mysterious type then? Well, when you put it that way... Second. I'm sure she just acts in an appropriate manner when conducting her duties as a messenger of this kind of Alright. There's enough of a lag to my voice in the text. I'm gonna try and up my, uh... Is there anything I can do to up my, um... I can do for um I'm gonna drop the delay I mean what comes out my output and nope I have streamed I have stream delay disabled. Okay. I'm sorry, but that, that, that delay is bugging me and it causes problems I'm doing editing. Sorry about that. Anyway, moving on. I suppose you're right. <clears throat> the problem is Soji. Since you joined up with Gardim, you seem to suddenly be serious about attacking us all of a sudden. I agree. I think you've made your peace with this decision, or am I hearing you wrong? Not necessarily. It's still bothering me a great deal. I haven't slept in days. But Knight and I decided that while we won't just stand by and let him defeat us, we also want to avoid hurting him if we can. 
So, what are you going to do then? As for that, I'm still thinking about it. I see. So basically, you don't have a plan. We'll do what we have to do. You're not sure of an exact plan of action, but we are prepared to do what it takes. Roger that. Just like I promised you, we'll be here to support you in any way that we can. Just don't forget this. Garden is not our only enemy. Understood. First things first, the Balan plan. According to the data we retrieved from our recon drone, over 10,000 ships have been amassed. A fleet of 10,000 ships? That's too many, even for defending a base. Many Officer Okada reviewed the data and came to the conclusion they must be amassing there as some part of some kind of ceremony. Hmm, maybe a naval review? Those 10,000 ships may actually be nearly the entire Gamelin fleet. The question is, why would they be holding such an event now? That is indeed the question. Commanding Officer Okada thinks that this could be our chance. Our chance? How so? Go in, blast the Gamelin fleet with the wave motion gun, and just like deal with a boatload of damage to them? Let's make a guess. Look, feast upon is your eyes upon this glorious sight. Indeed, Your Excellency. I'm not worthy of your appoint reappointment to me in the position of Galaxy Regional Operational Commander. I do have the words to thank you. Aha! Well, he's in league with the, uh, with the, uh, coup forces. I do not know why, but I hear that Admiral Dietz lacks his position and his daughter Melda is a wanted criminal. Aha! Because Dietz is the other person who knew, and so they basically cleaned out both people who knew about the travel plans. Interesting. Although we're able to get close to the Yamato, this dimensional rift issue is still unresolved as well. Things aren't really going as far away. You return from a parallel universe. Try to do a better job than Domo before you. Yes, sir. The job of Galaxy Regional Operation Commander was originally mine, after all. I swear to uphold the position to the best of my abilities. How are the fleets? Nearly all fleets scheduled to participate in the naval review here in Balloon have assembled. We shall be united in this time of unprecedented difficulty. That is my one and only mission. Ah, what beautiful sight to behold. The magnificence, the glory. Behold, the valiant splendor of Gamelas. Would the fleet I formed join at the bottom ranks? Absolutely not. Ugh. Purity is the only key to justice. Gamelas can and will be protected by the hands of the Gamelans. Yep, yeah, so... Okay. So this isn't an, an analogy for the uh, Hitler assassination because basically the guys who seized power are even heavier hardliners. They know Gamelin. They're not even in this universe. Just the thought of it is absurd. Y yes, sir. I, I understand, sir. All communications to all six. I have an important announcement to make. W what type of announcement? Just do it. Y yes, sir. Communications are now open, sir. Very well, let's begin. Greetings, brave and honorable soldiers of Gamelus. It's with great sadness that I speak to you all today, to those of you who withhold the honor of the great Gamelus Empire in war and in peace. For today, I must declare that our great supreme leader, Abelt Dessler, has passed on from this world. What? In this time of strife, who shall lead our empire? My soul trembles with the passion for this great and honorable task, but it is not without the deep and eternal sadness that we all share. And so, I shall make my declaration. I will carry on the will of our fallen supreme leader, and I will bring down the iron fist of justice on the crooks in this government who continue to hide his death. Let those of you who stand with me rise up, let us invade the imperial capital of Balaris and eliminate every last one of those scoundrels. We will exterminate them without mercy. They will pay for what they have done, every last one of them. Your Excellency, something is happening with the gate to the Milky Way galaxy. What? Some unknown entity is appearing with this sector right now as we speak. My God! That's the Yamato's music! The Yamato! The Yamato is here! Sorry. Not sorry. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the show, please like and subscribe. And also consider backing my Patreon. Patreon backers get episodes up to one week early of this show and any future Let's Plays. Also, please consider backing my coffee. 
uh, toss me a few bucks also helps support the show and it's not a monthly obligation or anything like that. 